because uh, really she totally understands the market from a technical, industrial, and, and marketing point of view. It's, it's it's really brilliant. So she creates Ampere Computing, and basically SoftBank still have uh, of um, ARM, but she deci they decide to put a little bit more money on ARM. And the breaking news uh, is SoftBank is buying Ampere. Ampere Computing exactly for six point five billion, I think. So she did okay. Yeah, she did okay. A $3 billion investment and, and got bought for 6.5, yeah. Yeah. I think I think investors have their return. I think they're, yeah, they're happy. And and uh, so so basically, uh, SoftBank is making the vertical integration everyone is speaking uh, about in ARM and everyone was trying to do. And do you think it will change a lot the, the ARM market? Because SoftBank will not close the ARM market, isn't right. it? I think they're, I mean, their goal in my opinion, will be to keep it open. So ARM has spent a lot of time getting into hyperscalers. And it's a big focus for them. And that's a door opener. These guys are market makers. So if you have that technology in the hyperscalers, that's good for ARM. That grows ARM. I mean, today we talk about ARM quite a bit, but they're, I think the, the market share they have is something like 5% of the total, total server market. It's, it's projected to grow and it's growing fast, but it's still not that much. So there's, it's a lot of greenfield right now for ARM server processors. So the, the ARM processor is like 99% of the smartphone market. Absolutely. 